We badly needed that win. It is a separation win. We know that we're still within the danger zone and we did not want to end up in what I perceive as the death trap. We don't want to be at number 9 and number 10. If we can evade the 7 and 8, that's also one of our goals, to be in the top 6. They came, they, they came back, but we hang on. It's just so nice to see guys like Chris Ross, who probably was already dismissed in the early part of his career, but right now we're seeing that he deserves to play here in this league. We are slowly getting the hang of preserving our win with our defense. And sure enough, they were not able to even launch a decent attempt when the shot clock was winding down. The character that you want in our team is we want to be constant with our defense. and be disciplined enough to execute on offense. I'm very happy where we are right now, but of course I'm not satisfied. We've won our last three games, and we will continue to be better in our next few games. So you have everyone believing inside your locker room? Every time we shout something, if we're trying to <clears throat> come out of the dugout, two words, we can. And right now we're believing and we're showing. It's not enough that we understand the concept, but we're doing enough of action to really make us believe that we can win consistently. This is what is nice about this team. I, I think nobody really gave us a, a, a ghost of a chance to at least compete, but right now it's a big test of our spirits. We're competing and we're winning. And we're not done yet. Well, the important thing in our team is we all know that Mac Mac can't just do it alone. That is the law of teamwork. In times wherein we struggled, Mac Mac would always be there to bail us out. And Gabby Espinas had a considerable amount of success in the first three quarters. No one man can do everything inside the court. But when the game was on the line, we had to call Supermac and he delivered. <laughs>